good day. This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news and reviews. Previously, we already checked on the heart rate monitoring or the heart rate monitor of this fitness tracker, the Galaxy Fit 3. And we compare it with the Apple Watch as well as the Xiaomi Mi Band 8. There are some requests that if we co we can compare it with a medical grade device just like we did with other wearables. So we have here our Omron blood pressure and of course pulse tracker or heart rate monitor checker. We have the Omron device here. It's a medical grade device that can check our heart rate. So we will check our heart rate here also in a Galaxy Fit 3 and we will compare it with our Omron device here. We'll also have a simultaneous monitoring to check whether the result is close to our Omron here or not. So if you have any questions regarding this video review, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if we do have the time. Alright, let's check. Again, we have here the Galaxy Fit 3. One of the uh, good feature, great feature of the heart rate monitoring sensor here is that it will not continue detecting your heart rate if you are not wearing the device properly. Let me show it to you. We have here the, our heart rate. If you tap on the measure, it will try to check and see if you are wearing the wearable properly. As you can see here, make sure your you are wearing your band securely on the top top or underside of your wrist, not against the bone. If it still doesn't work, try cleaning this sensor. Okay, so let's put it here. Let's wear it again. It's not detecting a war heart rate as you can see here if I will remove it as you can see it will not continue detecting again preparing checking and we have here the, the animation and the percentage of the heart of the monitoring it's almost finished 100% and we have here higher than average resting so we have 82 bits per minute. You can tag and check. So what are we doing? We're just resting. Let's select general. So we have here the 82 bits per minute of our heart rate. I don't know if we have the graphs here on the health section. We have the heart rate. And we have it here, 82 bits per minute. So we have our Omron medical grade device here. So let's have a simultaneous monitoring. Let's wear this tightly so we can check. Okay, so let's go to our heart rate. Then let's have a simultaneous monitoring. I'll start measuring when the air pump is done. So we have a much accurate result here. Measure. Let's see the results here. So we are done with our Galaxy Fit 3. We have 70 bits per minute and we have here 68 bits per minute. Very close. Plus minus 2. As you can see here, we have plus 2 for our Galaxy Fit 3. Let's have another one. We will measure at least 3 times. Just to make sure, start 
and let's see. We'll start measuring at 100. No checking. Sixty-eight, and we have here seventy-one. So plus three, very close. The result is very close. And last one. Let's have another one, just to make sure. Start. So, let's see, 144, 30, 12, and let's measure. We have 73, and as you can see here, we have the same results here very good so far then let's see the graph the year let's put this on the side let's check then we check down the graph let's go back to the health section heart rate we have here the graph resting range heart rate alert resting heart rate show on phone let's see we have here our smartphone show on phone and let's see the result here keep in mind that heart rate monitoring is for fitness so we have here the heart rate. So we have the graphs, 73 bits per minute. And we also have the time. Very good so far. We have the data here. You can also measure it here directly on the support app. Regarding the settings for the heart rate, you can also set it here on the Galaxy wearable. So Samsung Health, heart rate, you can measure continuously every 10 minutes while standing or manual only. So this one, it will make your device uh, deplete the battery much faster. So I set it to manual only. You can also set the high heart rate here and the low heart rate if you set it to measure continuously as you can see here the same with every 10 minutes for manual it is disabled so that's it for our heart rate monitoring of our galaxy fit 3 comparing it with our medical grade device here the omron so far the result is very close very good sensor for our galaxy so if you have any questions regarding this wearable, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if you do have that time. Bye!